welcome into the Kathy Raley Show. I'm Joe Wamba, joined with Kathy Raley, head coach of the women's lacrosse team. And, Coach, you guys get to play at home. Not with the result you were looking for. At one point, you guys had a 5-3 to three lead. Mm-hmm. What adjustments did Montclair State do that let them go on a 7-0 run? Well, I think there were there were a couple things. It was the craziest game, uh, of, officials wise. I mean, there were they a good officiating crew is not going to show up. Um, you're not going to notice them. Mm-hmm. You're not. You're they're going to they're going to kind of go in the foreground. This game was totally overly controlled by the officials. I think it took us out of our rhythm mm-hmm. and really elevated uh, Montclair. I think the key point was you know throwing Hannah Tankersley out of a game, and now she's got to miss the Washington College game is an enormous change in demeanor for our group, for something that was not egregious. That really threw us for a loop. So what we learned from that is you know, we, we can't control what the officials do. We've got to get out there. We've got to play hard for the full 60 minutes. We cannot worry about what they're throwing at us. Mm-hmm. Um, we just have to play the game and play it to our best ability. And we talk about you guys had the lead, uh, mm-hmm. especially at halftime. That first half, what was the adjustments? What were you guys doing specifically on the defensive side of the ball that allowed you guys to have that lead? Well, first of all, we had Hannah Tankersley in. I mean, that's that's a big, big component. I mean, she's six feet tall, and she covers a lot of ground. And uh, so putting a freshman in her spot, who, she did a great job. You're just down an experienced player. So I think that was part of it. The second part of it was our attack was not giving our defense a break. And when you don't give your defense a break, mistakes start to happen, and a good team is going to capitalize on that. When we are playing our best defense, it is when we get a minute break in between having to play long periods of defense and then turn around and let the attack do their job for a while so that we can regroup. And and that we were turning the ball over within seconds. Same story as Gettysburg. Mm-hmm. And we talk about it a lot, and we just can't seem to kind of follow that coaching instruction right now. Mm-hmm. I think you'll see a big difference on um, – on Wednesday, because we're really looking to control tempo, and we've got some ideas on how to do that, and there'll be some ramifications if we don't. Yeah, let's keep talking about that Wednesday game. You guys are going to be hosting Washington mm-hmm. before you guys go on your uh, sunny Florida trip. Yes. <laughs> Pretty excited for that one. But you got to get through Washington yes. first. And you guys learned a lot from these mm-hmm. past few games with Gettysburg and Montclair State. What is it that you guys are looking to do with this Washington we game? We have to shoot with accuracy. Uh, we shot the ball 16 times in the first half against uh, Montclair, and we scored three. Or whatever it was, so the five. I can't remember, but it was the 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 per shooting percentage on both three positions and just in regular offense is so poor. It's I mean we're not even coming even close to the cage half the time. So I think what really needs to happen, and and I really plead with the girls. We're getting a lot of shooting done during practice. We're getting a lot of offensive things done during practice. These girls who are not finishing need to grab a bag of balls and get out there and put in the extra time because it is going to cost us uh, some losses with the shooting percentage that we have. I think when you have two left-handed goalies, um, your shooting is so different and they're trained so different that when we get in a game with a right-handed goalie, it throws us off and we try to you know, really pinpoint the shot, which is why we hit the crossbar and why we miss a little bit wide. So they need to get out there and, and shoot and and just try to ping the corners and not so much shoot around a goalie as in develop great shots uh, within the cage. Well, Coach, we wish you the best of luck great. on Wednesday against Washington. Yes, thank you. She's Kathy Raley. I'm Joe Wamba. This has been the Kathy Raley Show.